On occasion, there are going to be some other objects that you need to place in our light. For example, gobo rotators, or maybe it's a zoom unit uh, and such. And this has different symbols on here with a guide on how to do that. Um, here we have a Z that's placed inside the unit uh, to make them a zoom. Notice that it's the old-fashioned unit or the newer unit, enhanced, and a regular zoom. These are all with either templates or gobos, different symbols. You can use the triangle, you can use the dot, or simply the letter T. Irises are either a circle or the, word, or the letter I. And here is a rotator, right, that symbol or an R. And here's a double rotator with a symbol or a double R. On our template, we happen to have the symbol, the little triangle, Right here, it even says template. There we go, little triangle. We've got the circle for these iris, and we even have a Z for the zoom. That's so tight, I'm gonna switch pencils to a new sharp pencil. And there's the Z. It sort of looks like a seven, but it's a Z. Other symbols that we might wanna to add to our unit if this unit has to have, wants a color changer. So here is a half inch color changer put on the front of our unit, just like so. And if you want to, you could even stick the little uh, round scroller circles on either side that's up to you. You don't really need it. As long as your key, which we'll discuss later, contains what all these things are, you don't really need that. Let's say we want to add a top hat right here, top hat. And it's possible on a par or really a, a more often on a Fresnel, but we can always use them on the pars. You might want to stick a pair of uh, a set of barn doors, which would be just like that.